Well, good morning everyone and welcome back to the outpost. I decided to have something a little bit different today, which would be pancakes, sausage, and I went and prex picked some fresh tomatoes off the vine. Um, the plants are kind of dying out, so I'm going to have to go ahead and um, salvage what I can. And uh, there may still be a few more. I mean, I do have some green ones, but uh, it's getting about time that I pull those plants up. What I've got planned to do today is to take that door. I need to put some cross pieces on it and I'll probably plane it down a little bit. Uh, the next thing for the door would be to take it, like I said, take it up to my neighbor's house and he is going to forge me some hardware for it. So that'll be another video. That'll be exciting. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and eat this, um, or these pancakes and this sausage. Let's see what it tastes like here. You know, I've said it many times, you cannot beat food cooked over the fire. Um, the grill is good, but doesn't match the fire. Um, it is just awesome. Anyway, let me finish this and then we'll get busy on the door and uh, see if we can't get it prepped to take it up there and get the hardware made for it. Thank you. 
right, guys, I propped the door up here just so that you could kind of get, take a look and see what it was going to look like. Um, still got the take it up to the blacksmith to have the hinges. Going to have a big round ring, and I've got uh, something planned for the door handle here. And that piece that I cut out up here, I'm going to use it to box in and frame this portion right here. But I needed to get this part cut out so that I could take it up there where he could begin to work on it. But I think that's going to look pretty nice. Um, this right here was store-bought lumber because most of what I have up here is not dried out to a very low percentage, um, any of it really. So I needed to buy this so that it wouldn't warp and shrink. Um, but this right here, this is cedar. Um, everything else is made out of uh, pretty much pine, yellow pine. But yeah, I think it's gonna look pretty good. So the door will actually swing. It's gonna swing out. This way right here, it's wanting to hang up. It will come straight out like that, and it will actually touch that. But that's that's all we need right there. So, yeah, it's gonna look really cool. So, excited about this little project here, turning out great. Hey everyone, yesterday I managed to get this door kind of uh, temporarily put in, took it up to my neighbor's house, he measured it for the hardware, he said you can actually take it back, which was nice because if I need to do kind of any adjusting, you know, it was nice to have it here. Um, but I was thinking as I was doing that, it's probably been a day or two since Jennifer's been here, I'm sure she's probably hiding in the woods somewhere. Um, but it... Hey, what we doing? Oh, Lord, help us. I know y'all have missed me. Well, maybe it's that I've missed y'all, but I'll tell you one thing. I've missed him. I think I hugged him yesterday when I saw him like five times before I let him go. He's just a little baby, and I just love him so much. Oh. 
Okay. Back to business. Anyway, do you know why Jennifer here is like a pine tree? I'm sappy. You're full of sap. <laughs> I'm just the sappiest creature. Anyway, you all, I have missed you so much and I'm so glad to be back here. We are gonna cook out today. I really think he must have missed me because he's decided to cook out today. Like, maybe I should have left more often. No, I'm kidding. Um, we're gonna cook out, or grill out some steak, some shrimp. We're gonna have beef ribs. Beef ribs, like, not that baby back got pork business. Two racks. Yeah, but beef. And salad. And corn on the cob and potatoes with onions. We are gonna be eating high on the hog or high on the cow. Is that what it'd be? Mm -hmm. Um, what we got in mind to do today, I'm gonna get some more of that plywood and see if we can't put it on the sides. I did get it put up in the roof area, uh, but I'm gonna put it around on the sides. So I'm kinda waiting on the hardware for this, but I was thinking about engraving in here with my chisels. SMO, what do you think? Yeah. Listen, y'all, it's going to be cute. Like I told you, Christmas at the outpost. It's cute. Okay, so let's get our tools and get busy. I'm going to mow here. Starting this fire about an hour early before I start cooking because I want it to have a good bed of hot coals. play poker in the wild. Too many cheetahs. <laughs> um, here's another cute one. You know why you shouldn't walk when it's raining cats and dogs? You might step in a poodle. <laughs> step on a poodle. <laughs> Step on it and step in it. Mm. 
Y'all tell them something about my shirt. This one's all broken. I like it. Looks like you've been eating spaghetti or something. <laughs> 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 She's got jokes, y'all. <laughs> no, that's probably like sweat and tears. It's actually tomatoes from when we've had tomatoes and stuff. And probably there's probably a little bit of pine rosin on it and all kinds of good stuff. I think some of it was uh, the kitchen right here mm -hmm. when we were building it. Yeah. Spaghetti. Looks like you dropped your spaghetti on your shirt. Yeah, well, you got something on one of your arms, too. I don't know. Spaghetti. But let me tell you, that's the best shirt for when it's hot and humid because it literally is, is the fabric that kind of stretches out more, you know what I'm saying? And it's not whatever this material is. Cotton? It's, it's a better cotton than this because it will, I don't know, it's just a little forgiving and it's amazing. By the way, for all you new folks, this is Ashley. Ashley made her debut last week when we decided that we were going to be the three musketeers and not stooges. <laughs> Although I did name them, I would be Mo, Dad would be Larry, and she would be Curly if we were the stooges. Hey, what are we doing? Shucking corn. Like I tell corny jokes. <laughs> Somebody said that one night on one of our lives. They said, you've been shucking a lot of corn, Jennifer. And I thought he was for real. I was like, yeah. I've taught a friend how to do it. I've taught a neighbor. And what he meant was I've been telling corny jokes. <laughs> August 29th, 7 p.m. Eastern Time. You better be there. You mean September. What'd I say? August. Did I? 26th! <laughs> had it all wrong. <laughs> hey, Jennifer, when are we going to have another live? September 26th, 7 p.m. Eastern Time. You better be there. When is it, Ashley? September 26th. No, no. Now you got me confused. No. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> look, look and see what Saturday is. I'll tell you. Hold on. It's the 26th. See, I was trying to say 26th. Yeah. You were going, no. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't. September 26th at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Got be it. there or you'll be a square. <laughs> oh, that's bad, man. I'm, I'm, I'm losing my mind, aren't I? Leave us some comments. Tell us what you think. Um, we have beef ribs. We have New York strip steak. And we have shrimp. Kind of like Jennifer. <laughs> <laughs> Top knot. <laughs> shrimp. I am a shrimp. Oh, let me cover this up so it will stay warm. Not. Hey there. Daisy. Daisy who? They see me rolling. <laughs> they hating. 
fix the doorbell because it don't work. <laughs> here, here. <laughs> that one gets 10. <laughs> I had some change. <laughs> Did he really just say that? <laughs> yeah. It was good. Knock, knock. Who's there? A little old lady. A little old lady who? Dang, all this time I didn't know you could yodel. <laughs> A little old lady. <laughs> well, y'all, we're going to eat our little salad. Now, if you notice, I'm really not uh, a rabbit. Um, don't really like a lot of lettuce, so I'm eating just a tad bit. Croutons can computers, cucumbers, <laughs> tomatoes, and some raspberry vinaigrette dressing. Fancy. We're going to eat dinner, and then we are going to jump on that little hobbit house down there and see if we can't get it all sheeted on the inside. So we're going to enjoy this feast right here, and we, when we're done, we'll meet you all back down there at the outpost compost <laughs> toilet. The Shire. <laughs> The that's Shite our Shire. that's our new habitat. Hello, darling. <laughs> it's nice ya. to see you. It's been, been a long time. <sighs> Just as lovely. working as hard as we have been or hardly working huh I said have you been working hard as we have been or are you, have you been hardly working I've been working hard I think you've been hardly working that's just me too
Well, there's big thunder in the works because it's getting really dark gray back over that way and back over there. It was supposed to rain tonight. So it's about time to close up shop. Um, I got just about all of the inside done. The girls, they got uh, the trailer half unloaded. I've got some live wood that actually needs to go over there behind the sawmill. But um, we knocked out a pretty good day's work. Knock, knock. <laughs> Who's there? Oswald. Oswald who? Oswald, my bubble gun. <laughs> <laughs> Will you please loosen your top knot? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Ashley, thank you for coming up here and helping us again. Thanks for and Listen, we love her more in Mountain Dew, just like we love y'all people. Um, I have missed everyone. I just have to say it again. And I missed my daddy. I just love him to pieces more than any Mountain Dew in this world. But hold on, hold on. She mauled me when I stopped at the store today to get the meat. Mm -hmm. She actually met me in there mm -hmm. and I thought she was gonna get picked up for assault <laughs> because she was all over me, just kissing and hugging. Mm -hmm. And just, just a little baby baby, just like that right there. But on a serious note, September 26th, okay, is our next live it is at 7 p.m eastern time be there or like i said you'll be square and i think jennifer and ashley have a, a little song and dance they're going to do for you no <laughs> <laughs> no <laughs> no no uh, i'm just teasing Maybe. um but we appreciate you guys stopping by and hanging out with us while we're working on this compost toilet and all the little activities that we've got going on here and the good food that we cooked up. Um, hope that it looked good, it was good. Hope that it made you hungry, um, because it was, it was really good. Um, it was amazing, yeah. so good. I told her, I said, you know, it even beats working, cooking something over that campfire, or like a campfire. Um, with the smoke, it's much different than like on a grill. It just tastes a whole lot better. And even though a grill is better than being on the stove top, but yeah. I do not eat any shrimp or anything without ketchup. Yes, I know that's weird. Crab, anything has to have ketchup. Today, folks, I ate my shrimp without anything because it was so good. It didn't have that gnarly little fishy mm -hmm. taste, nothing. It was smoked. Yes, it was so, so good. good. So, Dad, thanks for that. Mm -hmm. um, You're the real winner. <laughs> What's it? What is it? You're the real MVP. You're the GOAT. Okay. The greatest of all time. <laughs> I don't know if that's really what she means or not. She'll probably tell Ashley what she really means no. off camera. The goat, wouldn't you agree? Mm -hmm. Greatest of okay. all time. Okay. Um, we the hope Sour Patch Kid. <laughs> so, so <laughs> we, we the, the three stooges or musketeers. Yeah. We're, no. we're going to sign off. Curly. We, we hope Larry. that you guys have a great afternoon. Take care, and we look forward to seeing you back up here at the Outpost next time. And listen, guys. Don't forget to tell all of your friends to check us out and hit that subscribe button. It does truly help. Go on, Mo. Oh, I'm Mo. Huh. Early.